the foot of the Rocky Mountains. MLB The Show is on the air. Tonight, the opener of a three-game series between the Pittsburgh Pirates and the Colorado Rockies. Stay tuned for Rockies baseball next. Jeff Hoffman gets the call for game one of the series. What do you have for us on MH? Well, Matt, last outing he pitched eight solid innings. He pitched deep into the ball game, deep enough to get a win. And he's the type of guy that, that will go deep in games for you. So, Matt, I'm looking for that type of performance in this game as well. So, striding forward now, Tim Money. He comes in with 16 home runs on the season so far. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. The pitch, a fastball off his glove, and it bounds away. And he'll make it in easily at second, as I'd imagine that'll be scored a passed ball. Keep it going. 0 oh, and 1 count, and the pitch. Over towards the dugout, but this one will get into the stands. And he'll just get a piece here as this is chopped foul at home plate. I like the call for the two strike changeup. You got to make a better pitch. He got away with one right there. Very weakly on the ground. That's a foul ball. He's just fouling him off till he gets something he wants to hit. Hey, get your pitch. Stay hot up there. Hey, stay hot now. Another 0 and 2 coming. Oh, and he dusted him off the plate that time. Some mind games being played now. It's one and two. Well, what do you do when guys keep fouling pitches off like this? I guess now. you could back them off the plate by throwing one inside. Come on, big guy. Stay hot up there. Nasty breaking ball swung on in the dirt. Maxwell reaches out and tags him to make it official, and there's one away. A chance here to check out the starting lineup for the visiting Pirates. Who are you focused on, Dan Plezak? Well, I love watching Manny Machado do his thing. He had over 20 runs batted in last month. Very consistent. A solid month, and I love watching him swing the bat. Into the box, Jordan that Patterson. His average right for the fielder. year sits in the 280s okay. entering play. Patterson. Drilled on the ground is short. Money. Scoops it up in time to first, and there are two away. Time now from Coors Field to take a look at the Rockies' starting lineup. Dan, who do we keep an eye on? Yeah, I'm keeping an eye on DJ LeMahieu. He's got an on-base percentage of over 400 coming in. The elite hitters in the game put up numbers like that, so he has to be feeling really good about what he's done so far this season. I'm sure his club is pleased. Here's the second baseman, D.J. LeMahieu, and he enters play second today, baseman. currently fifth in the DJ National League batting race. Hey, two down here. Into the windup, here comes the 0-1. Hard hit ball to short. Gets dirty and gloves it. He's up with it. The throw. Hey now. The defense on display on this beautiful diving stop at short. Don't go anywhere. More Tuesday night baseball after this. Stepping in and ready for another shot. Tim Money, 0 for 1 here in the early going. Here you go, baby. Find a good pitch. Hey, let's go, big fella. Curveball is nowhere close, and it's 1 and 0. That curveball is a pitch you have to get on top of, or else it'll take off just like that one did. One time, need you right here. 
Hey, see, hey, drive it. Here we go. One and zero pitch on the way. In the dirt here. And he'll make it into scoring position here with two away as that'll be scored a wild pitch. I think this all stems from the fact that they're trying to make sure the guy at the plate doesn't hurt them at all. And with that base open at first, they might opt to just put him on. Hey, good one up there, huh? Two and oh pitch on the way. Too tight oh, with that one. Back. Three Great and oh. You can bet he's salivating a little in the box right now. He likes to drive in runs, and he's got a great situation and count to do that right here. Two out here and a runner at second. Swinging on 3-0, and but this is chopped foul right at home plate. Well, he fouls off that fastball right there, and you wonder, does he love his fastball enough to come back with it three times in a row? Three balls and a strike. Here's the pitch. And that misses ball four, so it's first and second now with two out. Yeah, the guy's been on fire lately, hitting anything close, so I think this is the way to go here. Get the bat out of his hands any way that you can. Digging in for his second at bat, Reed Comstock. Two on, Comstock. two out for him here in the third. Has a look, now the pitch. Now the double steal is on here. Pitch is a cold strike, the throw. Hey, that's not easy to do, to steal third off a catcher that has an elite arm like this. Great base running there. Come on now. One time. Let it fly. Ready on one and two. Here's a little chopper up the middle. Story brings it in. Throw in time, and the side is retired. Pirates get just the one, and that's all. We'll move on to the bottom of inning number three. It's the Pirates two, and the Rockies nothing. Coming to the plate now, Bruce Maxwell. He'll get us going in the home half Catcher. of inning number three. Bruce Maxwell. Hey, we got no one. Here he comes on a ball and two strikes. This is popped Turn up. up. Turn up. I go. I go. Under it is Machado, and he'll take it for the first out. And with that, we give you a look here at what's happening in the race in the National League Central. Digging in to try it again. Ken Beltre. Oh for one for him here in this one. Hey, come on now. Here we go. Runners are in first and second with one away. Hit out towards second. Reined in. One there. On to first. Not in time as the umpire was right there to make the call. Ready for another shot now. Tim Money comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ballgame. And now a bunt attempt here as he gets this one down. And he fans on the barehanded attempt, so that ought to be scored as a bunt single. And now confusion here with two men on the same base. One's got to go. And here's the German-born catcher, Bruce Maxwell. He leads off in the bottom of the fifth as they look to break through on the scoreboard for the first time in this one. Yeah, baseball is a game of adjustments, and it's time they start making some. They don't need to change their entire approach necessarily, but now is maybe when they start thinking about ways to get the guy in the mound out of his rhythm a bit. Here comes the 0-2 pitch. Hot. Money fields it cleanly. 
And they'll have no play as he reaches first base safely. So chalk that one up as an E6, and he really can't believe it out there. Striding in once again, Michael Franco. He started out the evening Mike 0 for 2 so far. Franco. No runs, three hits. Go, no man. errors in the ballgame for the Rockies thus far. To short, money is there. And he'll reach first as they can't make the play on him. So that'll go into the books as an E6, and he'll be kicking himself over that one. Ready once again, Bruce Maxwell. He's 0 for 13, 2 thus far in this one. Bruce Maxwell. And a fastball is hit on the ground towards short. Throw on to first, gets him, and the side is retired. Some more of the colorful characters here at the ballpark tonight. Back with more here on a Tuesday night after this. Ready for another chance? Tim Money. Pittsburgh. He'll be tasked Short with stop. starting things Tim as we begin the Money. seventh. Come on, baby. Into the windup and the pitch. Now a bunt attempt here, but this is foul for the first strike. Now a right-hander has started to get loose in the Colorado bullpen. On its way, the 0-1 pitch. And now a bunt attempt here as he gets this one down. Throw will not be in time as a perfect bunt there nets him a base runner to lead off the inning. The element of surprise, the big power guy comes up and drops a bunt down. When you're struggling, not a bad play. Even when you're hot sometimes, take the hit if they're giving it to you. So a runner at first now with nobody out. And standing baseman, in now, 13. the third baseman, Manny Machado. Manny Machado. Has a look, now the pitch. A pitch out, the throw. And boy, even a pitch out can't slow him down. He's in there at second base. I'm not sure what else the defense could have done there. They pitched out and the throw was pretty good, but they still couldn't cut him down. You kind of just have to hope he gets a bad jump. Hey, let's go, kid. One time right here. Pickoff move to second, and he has to dive, but he's back in easily. We're in the seventh now. Four to one, our score to this point. Now a spin and another throw back to second. And he is out heading back to second. Stepping up to the plate, Tim Money is looking for hit number three here in this at bat. Here we go. And here's a ball hit in the air. And he'll lunge out of the crouch to make the play for out number two. Now batting, second baseman, Willis Piper. Hit on the ground out to short. And that finds its way through for a base hit. Yeah, that's what you want to do when you're playing on the road. Take it right to the home squad and get a win. Now the pressure is off. If they get one of the next two, the series is theirs. 5-2 the final score tonight. Mike Clevenger notches his third win of the year. Justin Macias closes the door for the save, his 12th of the season. So that's a wrap here tonight. Coors Field on a Wednesday night. Tonight, the second of three to start the week between the Pittsburgh Pirates and the Colorado Rockies. Major League Baseball on the show is next. Chris Tillman is on the mound for game two. Harold, any thoughts? Well, Matt, his last three outings have been, I'd say, inconsistent. They haven't been good. His ERA is over four, just giving up too many runs. And when you give up that many runs, you're not going to win games. First pitch coming. Here it is. 
This is hit high in the air out toward left center. Beltre is in pursuit. He makes the play. A fine running catch to get the first out of the inning. And he will scurry back to first as he'll think twice about trying to move up. A chance here to check out the starting lineup for the visiting Pirates. Dan Plezak, who are you focused on? Yeah, I'm pretty excited. Now at the plate, Tim Money. 0 for 1 here in the early going. Tim Money. Hey, one time, right now. First pitch of the at bat. Swing and he pops him up over toward foul territory. Valaika has got it and the side is retired. Pirates leave one, but they're on top one to nothing. Now at the plate, Akinori Iwamura. He's 0 for 1 thus far. Akinori Iwamura. Hit on the ground to short. Played on the backhand. And the throw gets him at first on as fine a play in the hole as you're ever likely to see. Two away now. Digging in once again. Tim Money. No hits in two trips to the plate for him in the ballgame. Just lucky to make contact on that one as it's chopped foul. Now the pitch. Swing and a liner toward the gap in left center. But this will be pulled in out there in left center. Well hit, but a rough out number one. Good contact to start out the inning. Thought he might be on base with some sort of a hit. Now to the plate, Tim Money. Fourth trip to the plate for him, and he's at risk of ending that nice hitting streak that he's put together. Yeah, chances are it's on his mind, Matt, but you just have to let that get out of the way as best you can. You have to approach this at bat just like any other. Otherwise, you're just getting in your own way. This is where you got to pitch to the strikeout. Infield's drawn in. You don't want contact. You want to make him swing and miss. Throw the nastiest stuff you have. And this is bounced foul at the plate, and that moves the count to 0-2 now. Let it fly right here. Here's the 0 and 2. Not a bad pitch there with two strikes, but it misses 1 and 2. Definitely a strikeout situation here with that runner on first, so that's smart. Trying to make him chase that slider out of the zone. Ready to deliver the 1 and 2. Fastball stays way up that time for ball 2. All right, no more hoping he's going to chase. It's 2 and 2 now. You've got to come up with the best pitch right here because this is definitely a strikeout situation. And that's low, so a good eye there as he works the count back four. Wow, this is a pretty good at bat right here from down in the count 0-2 to work the count back to 3-2, and two, and he's seen a lot of pitches too. Let's go right here. He's set. Here's the three and two. And he takes ball four, so he's on. And as you know, that often means the steal could be in order here. Yeah, well, when a guy's swinging the bat as well as he's been, this is a smart move. No reason to tempt fate out there. Here's Manny Machado now. He's got a hit in three at bats to this point. Before the 0 2, a look to first. And he just manages to get his hand in. Now a right-hander has started to get loose in the Colorado bullpen. And another throw over. A dive, but he's back. Let it fly. Let it fly right here. Once more, a throw over. And the runner back. Four runs, seven hits. And no errors so far for the Pirates. Runner goes for second. A little bouncer. Drive it. Here's a look over to first, oh, and he'll get back in safely. Hoping to send him packing, pitch on its way. A shot down the first baseline. The second for one, relay to first in time, and just like that, the side is retired. One hit, one left. Stretch time coming up here in Denver. It's the Pirates four and the Rockies two. 
settling in now. Tim Money. And these guys are making a little push here. You have to like the effort despite the odds. Yeah, you really do, Matt. Look, they still have a significant hill to climb, but hey, they string a couple of hits together here, and all of a sudden, this thing feels doable. Well, these hitters can expect to see a heavy dose of that big fastball from this reliever. It's a major part of his arsenal. Second pitch is chopped foul right at home plate, and he's behind now 0-2. Hey, have a rip, kid. Here you go. Another one sent foul. Has him down to their final strike. Here it comes. Struck him out. And it's good night, Pittsburgh. 8-4 tonight. Colorado get their division leading 30 and win. Rainy Coors Field in Denver. MLB Network is on the air. Today it's the rubber match of this three-game series between the Pittsburgh Pirates and the Colorado Rockies. It's Rockies baseball on the show, and it comes your way next. Kyle Hendricks gets the start for Colorado in this one. HR, what's the word on him? Well, Matt, last game he pitched six full innings. He looked like he had good stuff. He didn't get a decision, but he gave his team a chance to be in the ball game. I look for a similar performance in this game. Into the box now. Tim Money looking for better results Tim than last night Money. when he went 0 for 4 in that one. Into the windup and the pitch. Hit sharply on the ground. Throw in the dirt, but a good scoop at first saves an error as the side is retired. One, two, three, go the Pirates. And now the Rockies will go on offense for the first time. No score. Striding into the box, Pat Velika. And he's hoping to get things going at the plate. It's been a bit of a struggle for him in recent games. Bottom of the second here with no score. Ground ball sent back up the middle. Scooped up. Only play will be to first as we'll see our first run score here as this is a one nothing ball game. A really good team at bat right there, right? Just put the ball in play. He does just that, gets the ground ball, and brings home the first run of the game. Ready now. Right, Tim Money. Go for one for him here in this one. Tim Money. First delivery to him on the way. And a changeup that just about got away from him there as that ran in a bit too far. Runner in scoring position at second with two down. Uh, had him lunging at that pitch away, and it's one and one now. Wow, that, that's a little bit of a surprise. You don't see too many ugly swings from him. He's having such a great year. You think he's on most things all the time. The set and the 1-1 one, one pitch. Just one caught ball. the inside corner with a sinker. They have a rip up there right now, huh? Ready on one and two. I had him guessing that time as he's barely able to foul it away. Hey, find a gap, kid. Find a gap. Hold the string on him. Strike three swinging. And that ends the inning. Here's the German-born catcher, Bruce the Maxwell. Catcher he drew a base on balls Bruce his first time up. Maxwell. Grounded to short. Backhanded. And he'll turn and fire a desperation throw to first. Throw. Got him. And that's a gorgeous play. Stepping into the box. Tim Money. 0 for Tim 2 on the afternoon Money. so far. Now, one time right here. Into the windup and the pitch. Yeah. And he's squaring around here, but he can't connect one strike. Now, a bunt attempt here. 
but that'll get foul. It's 0-2 now. Fifth inning of play here in a 3-2 ball game. And he's bunting here with two strikes, but he misses, and that's a rather weak out. Digging in now, Michael Franco. He's one for two in the ball game. Michael Franco. Hit on the ground out to short. Throw to first in plenty of time, and the side is retired. One, two, three, go. So coming to the plate, Tim Money, 0 for 3 with a couple of strikeouts for him to this point in the ball game. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Chopper foul. The 0 1 on its way. A leaping try, but it's out of his reach and into the outfield. He's around first, heading for two. And he's going to get to second now with nobody out. Yeah, I think he was sitting on the fastball, so he got the changeup. He was way out in front of it, but he kept his hands back long enough to keep it fair down the line. That's not always easy to do. Here's Manny Machado now. Two hits and three no, at-bats for him in this one. Manny Machado. Now a right-hander has started to get loose in the Colorado bullpen. Good lead there at second. Here's the pitch. Oh, had him off stride that time, and it's one and two. Now, Matt, that was a fastball. He, he had to have made up his mind that he's going to swing as soon as he releases it. That wasn't even a breaking pitch, and he was hacking. A throw behind the runner at second, and he'll dive back in safely. This one, everything we could have hoped for, three to two in inning number eight. Runner goes for third. Pitch inside the throw. And now he's tagged out, trying to scramble back to second. In now, Akinori Iwamura. He'll start things out, needing just a run to tie it here in the bottom of the ninth. Akinori Iwamura. Hit to short. Money gloves it. On to first, and that is a huge out to start the bottom of the ninth. Man, that's what you would call an efficient outing. One pitch, and he gets the save. He doesn't get paid by the pitch, so he just figured he'd end it quickly and hit the showers. Good call. A one-run game this afternoon, 3-2 to two, the final finish. Lee Song earns the win his second. Justin Macias hammers down the save his 13th of the year. So that'll just about do it for us this afternoon. Thanks to Harold Reynolds and Dan Plezak and the rest of our crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. This has been a presentation of MLB The Show. To find out more, head on over to theshownation.com.